Nice start also for Nakajima. We spoke about it a few minutes ago. About his birdie that he made on the first. This is how he got it. Just under 400 yards, the opening hole. So, player's mind is a good birdie chill. Demanding tee shot, this. It's aiming a long way left. Jamie, it's only about 35 yards from left trees to right trees. It's narrow. Yeah, he's played a little cut there, Jay, to come up short of the bunker, which he has done. That's perfect. Ball slightly above his feet. Looks like he's setting up for a cut shot. Little twizzle of the club is normally a good sign. Yeah, that was right at it. Oh, a little unlucky. One further yard on that, and that would have kicked onto the green and been very close. You'll be disappointed if you don't have this within a couple inches. We played it low. Wow. Good enough for Nakajima. And with the other two not looking like making birdie, he's, he's going to go further ahead here, you'd think. Six it is. 20 under par. I never, ever saw that at the start of the week, I have to say, when I turned up here. Well, he's birded it every day. It's his favourite hole. But there's only been four birdies on the sixth today. Oh, oh, oh. I think that's held up. I think it's held up, but... It's one of those shots you have to put back in your stance to try and keep the club face from shooting it left right away. You know, if you miss this green right, there's a nice chipping area. There's nothing wrong with that. Where's it gone? Where's it gone? Very sensible shot and an excellent shot from Nakajima. Well thought out. Nothing to do with the left-hand side there. Had a good look at it. I couldn't see a lot. If anything, as it finishes pace or starts losing pace, it might go a little bit left to right at the end. Others have struggled to get it to the hole. Keita Nakajima sends it right to the bottom of the cup. A third birdie in the first third of his round, and he moves to 21 under par. I think Nakajima played the previous hole in 12 shots for the week. That's a correct birdie every day, Jay. That's amazing. It is amazing. He just Looks like he got a little too much sand there. Yeah, he lost his balance a bit there, Nakajima. I think he's come up short in the rough, buried. Just a par for him on this hole then. Might have a little left to right bend to it as it loses pace around the hole. Well, the way he puts, you wouldn't be surprised if he drops that one in. I should think he's looking forward to getting on every green the way he's putting. Oh, it stayed there. It stayed there. So first drop shot of the day for Nakajima. He's back to 20 under par. I'm looking up the green, though. The, the flag is really blowing on the green. Can't feel it back here on the tee. a little anxious but uh, he's perfect now put it on the left side of the green if you pull a little bit you're in a chipping area with an easy chip oh he's gone for the low fizzer that's a surprise he's he's had a bit of luck you know could have gone in the water at six birdie that could have gone in the water there didn't key here is just if the grass is sticky just keep accelerating through the impact area
Well, he's making it easy for himself now, isn't he? Nakajima. And everyone else is falling away around him. And he not so much marches, he's sort of strolling to victory at the moment, isn't it? Nakajima trying to get it right in the, between the two balls already in the fairway. Three good tee shots there on 14. First job done. I'd say the second shot's harder. 215 to the front, 227 to the hole for Nakajima. Not an angle coming in from the right. Well, straight at it, but we know where that's going. Just doesn't need much, does it? Down it goes. Don't go in a divot. Well, we'll see whether a chip will putt that. I mean, it's so annoying when you go down there, Jamie, but it's a fantastic little sort of hazard, isn't it, really? Shuts the starts off, so he covers the ball with his shoulder. Yes. Well, that wasn't great. I don't think he knew what to do, really, there. Keeping the weight well forward. Yeah, he wasn't filling me with confidence there. He's done all right. I mean, it sort of duffed it down there. So difficult. Very fluffy around the greens. And a little downhill left to right up for a bogey five as well. Yeah, this is somebody to think about as well. Safely in, but he's back to 19 under. There's only there's going to be five in it soon. All of a sudden, I mean, not long ago, it was nine shots. It's okay, safely down the fairway. Twirl of the club means good, good enough. Yeah, if you break it down to swings, it sort of feels much more manageable, doesn't it? I remember Danny Willey did that when he won the Masters. This is coming down more across the fall line. Long gas was going up at some. This could actually be going down ever so slightly. And he's got it. Nakajima back to 20 under par. And six shots ahead once again. Shouts of four. Oh, and I think that's just kicked back down towards the green a little bit. All depends on the lie, but... Make sure you have a descending blow on this downhill lie. Catch the ball first. Just take your medicine. He's actually looking, to me, it looks like right of the hole and beyond. Well, he doesn't have to take it on, does he? <laughs> Four's good enough for him here, Nakajima. Right to left, and the wind is just, it just changed direction, and wind is just howling behind him, straight towards the hole. Well, it was a good try. No problem. Does he get the driver out like he did yesterday on the next hole? Uh, I say no. I say no as well. I'm asking for it to sit. Where, oh, where well. has that gone? I. I don't understand that shot, I really don't. Why well, put yourself under pressure, but he's got a big enough cushion. So 16 up, 13, 29. I think you're thinking 32. Flying it past the hole. A few yards, let it come back to slope. 
the miss that you can't make is short down that front side slope. Oh, this needs to get up, get up. And there it is. Well, it'll stay on the bank. Take it past the hole, use the slope. Something like that. Yeah, it wasn't a difficult shot, was it, to hit it up that slope, as long as you got a strike on it there. It's got this to stay in the red for the day. Start of the day, 18 under. And he's going to go back to 18 under. Yeah, five shot lead that'll give him. Oh, looks a horrible line. Look, it looks like all day long it's going to go down where Manasero was on that bottom layer, but we'll we'll see. It doesn't matter. One stage he was nine shots clear in this final round. And it is a first DP World Tour victory for Japan's Keita Nakajima. And what's more, he has won it handsomely. Keita, Hero Indian Open champion. Your first win outside of Japan, your 11th start on the DP World Tour. What does this mean to you to win outside of Japan? Uh, I feel like uh, just new first win in professional career. That feels amazing. There was a little wobble there at 14. You had a big lead. Did you get nervous? Yeah, middle of nervous. I had a tough back nine, but I can't. Yeah, I can just play golf. Hit some great shot. You've been a commanding world amateur number one you've had an amazing early start to your career yeah. so my next question is what are your goals for the rest of the year where do you want to get i want to try the top 10 this tour then go to the pga tour in 2025 that's my this year's goal enjoy that first win it was a great one thank you thank you so much appreciate it to watch another dp world tour video click here and to subscribe click here